What's up, Power Ups? My name is Jason. Welcome back to One Up Pokemon. And we're back with another opening. Today we have more Evolving Skies. This time, a build and battle stadium. Now, I want to apologize for last week. I didn't put up a video. I got a little under the weather. So, sorry for that. Feeling better now. Let's get back into some pack openings with this build and battle stadium. Now, this is just like a giant build and battle box uh, for the pre-release. It does come with two. Actually, turn it around. I'm going to show you what it says. Uh, here we go. You get two of individual build and battle boxes. You get evolution packs contain one of four. Oh, oh, so that's just what's inside the build and battle. And then you get four additional evolving skies booster packs. So you get 12 packs in all from here. And then you get energy cards, da uh, dice, uh, a coin, markers, and a collector's box. So this is just pretty much like a premium uh, elite trainer box. To be exact so yeah let's open this up see if we get some good pulls i've heard nothing but good stuff from building battle boxes i've only opened up one on the channel but yeah that didn't feel like even cut there we go let's see if we can get something good from the building battle boxes in here the pull rates from those are supposed to be really good didn't get really much of a sample size with just one so let's see oh that looks nice so yeah just like a elite trainer box except the inside doesn't have any artwork uh, normally elite trainer boxes have the pack artwork inside for that but it does have the same kind of design as an elite trainer box and it's is it a little bit bigger it's a little bit taller than the ones you see back here but it's still the same design let's open this up and there we go we got our two build and battle kits in here if i can pull them out there we go one two we got our two set them up right there we get our Four extra booster packs. I love these packs so much. We got our two uh, condition markers. And then we have our dice. Nice. I like this. I like... Does it have the... Where's the... No. I, say, I thought I was going to have the Evolving Skies logo on here. Uh, like the other dice do. Actually, I do have dice right here. Um, but yeah, the Evolving Skies logo. That's what it is. I thought I was going to have that on here. That would look really nice. But it's just regular dice. And you get this huge stack of energies. Alright, actually I'll take that out. Let's close this up now. There's no uh, code card in here. I guess because there's no... It would be nice to get some more sleeves. But there's none in there. So close that up. Push out the other stuff to the side. We have our two bit on battles. We have our four packs here. Let's lower the camera down. Like that should be fine. And then let me go ahead and open up these build and battle kits. Uh, I believe I've only pulled the Zapdos. So looking for the Moltres and the Articuno. That would be sweet if I could pull both of them from here. A Flaffy would be nice too. That is a great card to build a deck with. But let's go ahead. Grab these two out. Push those to the side. Let's see. Our first build and battle kit is another Zapdos. Wow. And I pulled out a pack. So I got another Zapdos. Uh, don't like to double up on cards. But Zapdos I don't mind. Let's see. Can I get a different one or am I going to get another Zapdos? Another Zapdos? What is this? I like Zapdos. It's my favorite Galarian bird. But I would love to pull the other two. But I'll take it. I'll take it. Or at least a Flaffy too. A Flaffy would be nice. Set those up back there. And then we'll just go one, two, three, four, and we'll just do the first as the build and battle kits for the packs. All right, I guess let's get into it. But put you guys up back there and see if we can pull an an alternate art card. Pull packs. Uh, this will roughly run you about sixty to eighty dollars, depending on where you get it from. Uh, that's roughly where I see them going for for it in terms of prices. One, two, three, four. But 12 packs, two building battle kits, not not a bad deal. Pretty good. Lombre, Vigoron, we got a Hypno, Teddy Ursa, Hoppit, Hitmonchan, Fletchling, we got a Tentacool, Reverse Bergmite, and a Sharpedo. Come on, let's at least get a good full art here too. Ooh, Pikachu. Pikachu be worth a million dollars in like 10 years. One, two, three, four. 
We have Electric Energy, Lombre, Hypno, Vigoroth, Pikachu. We have a Lotad, Pumpkaboo, Emoga. We got a Woobat, Reverse Hitmonchan, and a Thiebol. 0 for 2. Come on. Let's get a good hit here. Packs are opening up very clean. 1, 2, 3, 4. Sorry, on Fighting Energy, Shell Gone, Eskew, we have a full face guard, oops, Love Disc, Fletchling, Chen Chow, we have a Patella, a Petalil, Feebas, Reverse Ribbon Badge, and an Altaria. Come on, this is the last pack of one of these uh, building battle kits, so hopefully we get something in it. Please, give me one good pack. And I think we do have something in here. Co card. One, two, three, four. Okay. Unfortunately, it has. Oh no, that's Beast of Lint. I thought it was a Nick. No, it is a Nick. Dang it. Well, oh, it is. I think it's just a regular V. Toy Catcher, the Paladin, Golduck, Sableye, Teddy Ursa. We have a Mareep, Zarua. Tentacle Reverse is a Drampa. And. It is a Lycan Rock V. So we got one Ultra from those four packs. All right. Next building battle kit. Come on. Like, it's nice to get a bunch of these packs. The building battle kit is cool. Would have wish it would have came with some sleeves. That'll be really cool. But it is what it is. Uh, four. We have a Grass Energy, Shell Gone, Eskew, Full Face Guard, Pumpkaboo, Bagon. Love Disc, C Dot, Slack Off, Reverse Feebas, and a Litigant. Alright, that was only the first pack, right? Yeah, that was only the first pack. Ooh. These are just opening up like a little bit like butter. They're ripping pretty easily. Alright. Code. One, two, three, four. Starting off with a electric energy. A Flaffy. That's a nice one. Graveyard. Switching Cups, Bergmite, Carvana, Emoga, Slacka, Gossy Floor, Reverse is a Gorgeist, and a Hollow Victini. I'll take that. I haven't pulled this one yet. Okay. So, two more packs left, and then we get into the loose packs from there. The so far, Bid on Battle Kits. Letting me down. One, two, three, four. Especially that I've only pulled the Zapdos, too. Would have been better if I would have got at least a different pre-release. The Million Dollar Pikachu in 10 years, Applin, Lillipup, Emoga, Tentacool, Reverse Hydreigon, that is a nice one there. And an Appleton. Alright, final pack from the Building Battle Kit. Come on, you gotta give me something good here. At least an one Ultra. Code. One, two, three, four. We have a Fire Energy, Vigoroth, Treasure Energy, Ribbon Badge, Temple, Cutie Fly, Appleyn, Sableye, Nicket, Aroma Lady, and a Seismitoad. Wow! Only one hit each from the Le from the Build and Battle Kits. That's bad. Alright, now it's time for the loose packs from the actual box. Code. One, two, three... Four. Starting off with Water Energy, we have a Lombre, Scrafty, Lucky Ice Pop, is it lucky though? We have a Tentacle, the Million Dollar Pikachu again, wow, C Dot, Lily Pup, Reverse Cutify, and an Entei Hollow, okay. So there's hope that maybe we could get more than just one hit, but we also did pull that Victoria from the second pack. Let's see here. Alright, come on. Can we get one old, like, one, four? One, two, three, four. Because 12 packs is the equivalent of a third of a booster box. So we should pull at least another Ultra out of here, right? Aroma Lady, Rescue Carrier, Rufflet, Drowsy, Flabebe, Rock and Roller. We have a Psyduck, Reverse is a Slack Off, and. Hey, here we go. A VMAX, 51 of 203. Where is that at? Is that Flareon? Jolteon! I pulled you already, but I'll take another one. There we go. Alright. 
So that is our second Ultra. I'll take it. So far, the only new card that I pulled from the hits is the Victini. All right, next one, code. One, two, three, four. Starting off with a Water Energy. Gordy, Zwellis, Nuzleaf, Carvana, Dwebble, Mareep, Drowsy, Scraggy, a Reverse Scraggy, and another, this Garbodor. The fuck? Garbodor, okay. Don't remember if I pulled the regular Ultra, but I know I pulled the Rainbow, but okay. Three Ultras from 12 packs. I'll take that. That is five hits. If we could get another hit here, then that means every loose pack from the uh, Build and Battle Stadium had a hit, which is way better than Build and Battle Kit. One, two, three, four. All right, let's see. What do we have here? We have a Dark Energy, SQ, Scroll of the Flying Dragon, Crustle, Emoga, Tentacool, Pumpkaboo, Bagon, Love Disc. We have a Temple Reverse and. 115 Hydreigon Hollow. All right, so the only two new cards that I got were two hollows, which I'll take. For some reason, the hollows are hard for me to pull, or getting some of the certain hollows, but not bad. I was getting a little down on it, but all in all, six hits from 12 packs. Again, that's like a third of a booster box, so it's not bad. Good hits. We have the Hydreigon Entei. That's like really awesome artwork there. Nice Entei. We have Victini, Lycanroc V, Garbodor V, and Jolteon V Max, which is the only evolution I seem to be pulling, which I don't mind, my favorite evolution. Just need the, the rainbow art of him. But that's gonna do it. Hopefully, you enjoyed. Oh, and also, I got the two Zapdos, which I already pulled one, so would like to get the Articuno or the Moltres. But yeah, that's gonna do it. Hopefully, you enjoyed. If you did, hit that like button. Don't forget to subscribe to catch more. Don't think I said it in the beginning. But remember, subscribe and hit the like button and hit the bell. But until next time, Power Ups, have yourselves a great day and I'll see you in the next one.